And today, we're gonna make Jen work on the car. <laughs> you're gonna get all dirty in your nice clothes, but you can't wait. I can't wait. Yeah. Look at that, I got my car parts too. Yay! What are you doing? Well, I'm working on the car. This is actually, this makes me feel good because that differential looks so good. What's the differential? That's this whole, this, this whole, whole assembly. Okay. Yeah. This uh, makes it, this takes, here's the way that it works. Engine sits back here like where I am, Okay. right? Goes through one of these, these three splines. I don't know which one. I think it's this uh, outer one actually. Nope, the inner one, this, this medium sized one, right? Okay. Goes to the transmission. And then the transmission puts it into a gear, right? Mm -hmm. And then it comes back through on this shaft right here. Mm -hmm. And this, this gear turns this big gear, which in turn turns the tires. So what you're telling me is that you drive a big clock. I drive a giant clock. But here's what I'm excited about. Every other part on this car looked terrible. This one looks okay. Like all in all, like sure there's, there's, goo in here <laughs> but for the most part the goo has been like forced to the outside you don't want the goo the goo's bad no the goo's bad like that right there that's not that's mm -hmm. not good this is what i would find in the transmission that i was like wow looks like somebody put mud in the transmission Ew. this little gear right here uh -huh. turns another little gear i don't know if you can see that shaft right there right where? way down inside of there okay that is the gear or the shaft that turns and turns the speedometer cable, which then goes up to where the speedometer is, which is out in the grass. Uh, yeah, on the invisible car. Invisible car. This is a skink. Whoa. Uh, oh my gosh. Yep, now I need that was so cool. It was really pretty. Do you want to tell them what you did? I shook the differential off, and it's very heavy. There it is. Yeah, work, slave. Gets to cleaning. I ruined my root berry shirt. Oh no, it's still good. Just took cleaning car parts. Yeah. Why oh, look how rainy it is, shovel eight. It's uh, pretty rainy. Definitely pretty rainy. Dominus Thunder. Being uh. I had a hard day's work. Being manly and in the fields. Having yourself a beer. Look, I have dirt on my face and everything. It's real. I really did hard work. Look at my shirt. Yeah, look at her shirt. Oh my gosh. You'll sleep well tonight. I had it on my leg too. Yeah. You're so dirty. Look how fancy he is with his glass. Yeah. Nice hit. Yeah. Look, oh, he's got... Oh yeah, check it out. He's uh... <laughs> chug, 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 <laughs> he chug, does, chug. He does Pilsner all <laughs> Rick or something. This oh, yeah. is... That's, that's my dad. <laughs> Check it out, it's pretty fancy. I know, right? Imported from Czechoslovakia. You know what's really funny? Or the Czech Republic. Is after oh. all of that, he didn't burp at all. <laughs> <I'm a bitch. laughs> He's Just, a real man. Not, not right now. <laughs> yeah. All right. Going to two J's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And Jen has a hat. Yeah. I like it. You look like it. You should make a duck face. Because you're like have a little duck bill. Yeah. Ooh. What does that say? Mermaids. Mermaids? I don't know what it says. All right, so you guys saw how much it was storming outside earlier, and my dad uses his phones a lot for, for work. If you guys, we don't have a house phone, but if you guys have a house phone, I would probably recommend buying either a Panasonic or a Uniden because these things got soaked in the rainstorm because they were out here, and both of them are still working. That is impressive. Actually, we didn't actually turn it on to see if I got a dial tone. Let's try it. Connecting? Dial tone. Oh, that's a good one. All right, let me see if this one still works. Should I, I should do like speaker. Can I do speaker? Yeah, look at that. At dinner, my dad was telling us a story about one time he went to a restaurant and the waiter was, or waitress, was telling them a story like They're, about you other. Call them, you call them servers now. Server. The server was telling him about a another restaurant that was not as nice as the restaurant they were at. And she called it dank. Don't do that. Don't don't call anything dank. No, no. At she your said job. it was it was better. Oh, it was better. She said world of beer. If you guys, you I'm trying, well, you're not wearing your seatbelt, so I didn't want to point it out. Uh, it was just a two minute car ride. It doesn't matter. I know. I'm sorry. When I was a kid, my 
my grandpa told me that it was unsafe to wear seatbelts. And I know that's crazy and all, but I'm sure you guys have a crazy family member also. But so now I'm like, don't want to wear my seatbelt because it's unsafe. You know, if somebody told you something when you were younger, it's all mental. It's like you hear, oh, don't, my grandpa is from West Virginia. And so he's very much, don't wear your seatbelt because it's not very safe. And I, so now that's what I think of. I think don't wear your seatbelt because it's, it's unsafe. Don't park in your neighbor's yard like in their grass, you jerks. Well, we were supposed to go to a, um, like a wine and we had this group on that we bought for um, like a wine and cheese thing that uh, we were supposed to go to tonight. But first things first, I got back from dinner and I started editing and it's 9.41 now and I just finished. Yay! You guys better watch yesterday's video. I put a lot of work into it and it's long. Jen had to go with her friend to the hospital. Not Jen didn't have to go to the hospital. Her friend had to go to the hospital. She's having some, st her friend was having some stomach issues where she couldn't hold down food or anything like that and she was starting to feel real weak. So they took her to the hospital and they're still trying to figure out what's going on. I don't know. Hopefully everything's okay. I know it's dark, but I just wanted to show you guys. Armani pretty much like, Walks normal. And on that wonderful note, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Now it's time to pay the price. Whoa, wait, wait, wait. Before you guys go, I challenged uh, our friend Matt, funny me now, youtube.com slash funny me now, to do a the chili pepper challenge. He drank an entire bottle of chili pepper. So, uh, I mean, the least that you guys could do is run over to this channel. I'll put a, an annotation somewhere around here that uh, go over and leave, leave a comment on his video that says, holy cow, I can't believe the Tim Tracker got you to do this and maybe stop by and subscribe. I'll see you guys, I already said this part.